Let's take a look at what's trending after hours. We got three stocks for you. And as you can see on your screen, a lot of green. Let's kick it off with Meta. We're looking at gains of just about 18% in extended trading. Revenue very strong for its most recent quarter, beating the street's estimates, coming in just above 32 billion. Daily active users was also better than expected, just at 2 billion flat. They also announced a $40 billion boost in share buybacks. Ad impressions during the quarter were up 23%. And you're looking at an 18% gain in extended trading. If that holds through tomorrow's trading day, that will be the biggest intraday jump that we have seen since 2013. We know 2022 was a very, very tough year for Meta. Taking a look, though, how the stock has performed year to date, we're looking at gains of just over 27%. Moving on to Align Technology, that stock popping in after hours trading as well, up just about 15% EPS and revenue, both beating the street's expectations. If you're not familiar with the company, it's a medical device company. They're the owner of Invisalign, which of course has been very popular now for quite some time. The company also okaying a $1 billion buyback. I do want to note that the company did not provide full year revenue guidance. They did cite macroeconomic environment and also continued global challenges here as a reason for that year to date. You're looking at gains of just about 33%. Let's take a little bit of a longer term chart here and look at three months. Three months, they're up still big, up just about 46%. And rounding it out with Elf Beauty, that stock also popping up just about 11% here after hours. Certainly looks like people are spending money on cosmetics. Elf Beauty beating the street's expectations here, boosting its full year EPS and sales forecast, beating on top and the bottom line. Over the past three months, looking at gains of just about 33%. So really bucking the downward trend that we're seeing, more broadly speaking, in the consumer discretionary sector there, Dave. Okay, good job, Shauna. Thank you.